Welcome to the Tradex Foods 3 Minute Market Insight. Here's the seafood news for the week of February 18th, 2013. The World Wildlife Fund submitted a formal objection to the proposed Marine Stewardship Council certification of the Russian Pollock fishery. The WWF's objection follows a previous formal objection submitted by the At Sea Processors Association early last week. WWF's objections, which, objection, which expresses concern about the assessment process of the fishery, is, expect, is expected will be posted on the MSC website by the end of this week. For more information on the status of this assessment, visit the MSC website. The news regarding an indefinite delay in certification has had an immediate impact on the current Alaskan MSC certified Pollock fishery, which is currently underway. Prices for Alaska MSC H&G Pollock increased from 73 cents to 79 cents US dollars a pound CNF China port following MSC's announcement of the WWF's objections. Alaskan processors are reporting large volumes of product are being booked and sold to China. In order to compete in markets where consumers demand MSC certified products, Chinese processors are committing to MSC certified raw material. Alaskan longline at sea processors are actively, actively fishing Pacific cod. The European market for collarbone on fish is poor, with fish ranging between 2,500 and 3,300 US dollars per metric ton, size dependent. The domestic market for J-cut fish is also down, with East Coast USA prices ranging between $1.50 and $1.70 US dollars per pound, subject to size of fish and quantity purchased. Buyers of frozen at sea longline cod continue to report highly competitive prices for collarbone on longline harvested frozen at sea Atlantic cod. We will continue to follow this fishery and update on market conditions. Lent and Chinese New Year are both factors that may have influences on influence on the market over the next four to six weeks. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Robert Ryerson. Buy smart and eat more seafood.